Hi, I'm Ellen Fine. Hi, I'm Sherry Schneider. And we're here to talk about our latest book, Not Your Mother's Rules. I think the biggest one is, one of them is to interrogate him about Facebook. You know, because everyone's on Facebook, and now your friend's on Facebook, and you see what he did last week on Facebook or the other night, and you ask him about it. Who's the girl in the photo? And I just think you feel it. You're starting to sound like his mother, and he's getting a little turned off. Another big turn off is codependence. It's like, I can't live without you, and you're my everything, and you write on his wall, you're my everything. <laughs> they can't take it. Yeah, they, they just feel like... They um, want a woman who's complete without them. Yeah, they want a girl that works or studies, goes to the gym, has a life, because if, if he's her everything, then he's going to feel like overwhelmed, and it's not good. He'll run. You know, talking like girls are obsessed with food to some extent, so talking about your calorie intake, and how Weight Watchers isn't working, and how you really should go to get to the gym, but you don't have time. It's like, just guys are like very practical. Yeah, they're like, just, just do it already. They're I don't very want to hear about they're it. They're solution oriented. They don't want to hear the whining. So don't complain about your weight or your gym membership expiring. The rules are all about myst a little bit of mystery and a little bit of unavailability. And technology is all about being completely available and no mystery. You know where everybody is. You know, they just went to Starbucks, you know what they got, you know what Starbucks location they're at, they take a photo, they, they, they put their order down, they, they, they tag whoever was with them, and it's like they're, they're polar, they're like swimming against each other, mystery and, and, and technology. And so we, tr we wrote Not Your Mother's Rules to apply the rules to technology with, and doing it in a very sensible way. If you lost your phone for a few hours and you didn't text a guy back, it wouldn't be such a bad thing. Calling all my girls.